and welcome back. Today we're going to be talking about language goals and using a bullet journal for language learning. This year I'm using a bullet journal for the first time to track my language learning progress. This was completely inspired by Polyglot Progress, whose channel will be down below, of course. And let's just crack into how I'm using the bullet journal to track my language learning. As you can see, my first page is my goals page. I split it into general life and languages, with languages being split into two parts, Spanish and Italian. I will fill my goals in later this video. Next, I have monthly recaps for both Italian and Spanish, with a space for a whole year recap at the end. This means that I can write a little bit about how that month went. Finally, I have a daily recap, just for me to put which languages I studied that day, so I can see which I do more often. I have a highlighter for each language, and at the end of the day, I will highlight with which language I studied. Now, time for the goals. With goals, you need to be both realistic and specific. So with Spanish, I want to feel comfortable with pluperfect and past perfect tense by the end of the year. I also have a Spanish book, which I want to finish, though I imagine it could take quite a while, so I put it as a year goal. I want to work on speaking, so I'm going to put do 10 italki lessons. I know this doesn't sound like a lot, but I've never used italki before, and I can easily see myself getting very busy this year, so not having time to do many. I would also like to reach the fifth checkpoint in Spanish on Duolingo, as well as be able to write 300 words on an area of my choice which uses a range of tenses and adjectives, as well as uploading two videos of me speaking Spanish, though I can use a script for some help. I have smaller goals as well, but these are my year goals. Now for Italian. There is a long way to go with Italian. I want to be able to speak confidently in the past and learn one future tense as well as get to page 114 on my Easy Italian Reader book, as well as making a video only in Italian, though I can have a script. That will probably be more near the end of the year. I would also like to get an A on my higher exam for Italian, as well as be able to watch a vlog with, Fran with Learn Spanish with Francesca, with only Italian subtitles and understand all but 10 words to give myself a little breathing room if I don't need, I don't need to understand it all as well as be able to write 200 words about an area that I'm interested in. As I hope you can see, I have tried to make my goals specific and achievable, and I target different parts of the language. I hope you enjoyed listening about what my goals are this year, and it's inspired you of what you could do this year, and also how you could maybe use a bullet journal this year to help with your language learning. I might adjust my goals throughout the year, depending on how achievable I deem them to be. And if you like this video, please give it a like, and comment down below what are your goals for this year. And if you want to see some more language learning content, please subscribe. But for now, see ya.